Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review The Sleep Experiment. And this is a new horror thriller from writer-director John Farrelly, and this focuses on two detectives interviewing this scientist researcher who winds up depicting a horrible study, an experiment where five men were locked in a small space and had to stay awake for 30 days to be released from prison. And guess what? It didn't go well. Surprise, surprise, when you put a bunch of killers together. And this film is just like an hour, 20 minutes. It is a short film. It gets to the point. It doesn't prolong anything, which I appreciated. has a good pace. It has good mystery about it. You keep pulling these threads, and it has twists and turns along the way. Maybe some of them were a little bit more obvious than others, but I think for the most part it's pretty effective. From a directing standpoint, there's atmosphere, there's intensity, it's an unnerving experience, and from a story standpoint, that those twists and turns and where it winds up could be pretty shocking. But from other perspective, in terms of some of the other writing, the dialogue is very clunky. There's also very exposition-heavy moments throughout the film where a bunch of stuff's just explained to us. And even up to, like, the final reveal, basically it's like a bad guy just being like, let me tell you everything. And just like, but did we need that? Did we need you to slap us in the face to be like, yes, these were my plans, this is everything I did, and my motivations. And it's just like, okay, well, definitely telling me, not showing me, very, very much in this particular film. But, you know, it's one of those kinds of experiences where it's just like, it also gets brought down by a lot of really stiff, awkward acting. Um, this wasn't the strongest cast of actors. Nothing against them, but it's just, it felt like a lot of amateur actors here. And a lot of these scenes that should have been that much more impactful just didn't deliver because they didn't have the weight behind it. And in general, besides like, you know, the lackluster acting and some of the heavy handed dialogue that kind of spells it all out for you. This was such a cool and interesting concept. Obviously, we all knew this was going to go wrong. Like, there's no bones about it. This just sounded like a terrible idea. But the thrill that it takes us on, it had some great potential. And it winds up coming out pretty being, being pretty middle of the road, kind of messy, lackluster in way, kind of horror thriller. But if you're really into the genre, I think you'll get enough out of this. And I think I got a solid experience out of watching this short but su short and sweet but pretty demented horror flick. But those are my thoughts on The Sleep Experiment. Let me know what you think and let's talk some movies. But thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.